you guys remember i told you guys i'll drop a video about the van that i purchased so this van i'm sure you've probably seen it in other videos from that other detailer he does youtube also so i had leo go all the way to sacramento to pick up this van and deliver it over here but honestly i listed it for sale and i have a potential buyer that's coming today so we'll see right now i'm gonna head out to the job site we got a full detail on a range rover exterior interior all that but if not I'll show you guys the inside after I'm done with that client. But like I said, I scheduled with the guy. He wants to come check it out. Probably wants to buy it already, you know? I haven't had it for even a week. So we'll see how it goes. We're gonna go knock out that detail. You know, I'll show you some videos right now and we'll see how it goes, man. So we're heading over to that detail. My bad, you guys, I'm gonna be driving. But yeah, so I picked up that van. Uh, you guys may recognize it from Hunter's mobile detailing videos. Yeah, so I had Leo go all the way to Sacramento. You know, I sent Hunter the payment. He met up with him there, and then he made all the way back here to LA. He actually made a pit stop with some friends he has over there in um in Bakersfield. He spent the night over there. Actually, he stayed for like two days. He's really close to them. So he spent, yeah, like two days over there, and then he finally brought it back over here. And honestly, he had no problems. Um, so... Also, what was included in it was a, a Kranzel pressure washer, a water tank, a generator. I haven't actually had a chance to even test any of those because we've just been so busy. But, um, you know what I mean? So hopefully, we'll see if it sells today. If it sells, then there's not much to show you guys. If it doesn't sell, you know, we're gonna clean it up. The headlights need to be restored. Interior needs a detailing, honestly. You know, we're just gonna get it looking cherry. And we'll see if we use it, you know, in any of our, you know, or anything else or if honestly i just end up selling it so i listed it for sale i listed it pretty high to be honest i didn't think it was gonna attract a lot of buyers but honestly this dude actually hit me up that he wants to live in it so he's gonna use it like as his as his home he said he's gonna build out like a bed and all that you know so i mean good for him i mean that's just it just goes to show how how rough it is here in la like everything is expensive the cost of living you know Everything is just crazy. But yeah, well, we got lined up today. It's a Range Rover. We cleaned the car in August. I just checked the calendar. And I mean, it was a first time client. Uh, she was referred to from another client. And so the other client is like a bi-weekly service on her G-Wagon. So yeah, um, the first time we did her, this, this client's vehicle that we're doing today, she tried to get a, you know, a discount. Like, oh, you know, this person referred me. Can you guys do a little bit better? And, um, you know, I'm like, you know, we, we have to stay, you know, stick to our guns. But, yeah, she's like, you know what, it's fine, I'll pay. And she liked the work, and, you know, here we are, August, September, October, November, like four months later, and we're going to do a full detail on our vehicle again. It's It amazes me how, how you know, how we've been, like, consistent. I wouldn't say we're busy. Like, I wouldn't say, like, I wouldn't lie to you guys and be like, you know, we're super busy, super booked. You know, we're just doing, like, details here and there now at this point one or two a day sometimes just one a day like today we only got this one but um you know at least there's work we got a storm coming in tomorrow but um yeah you know it's gonna be like you know so for the next like five days something like that we might not have work at all not much work or not work at all but you know that's the thing you gotta like you gotta save for a rainy day you gotta prepare you know what, you guys, I'm just talking a lot right now. Let me know if you guys like this. Do you guys like when I just go on, when I start rambling, give, you know, telling you my, my thoughts, what I'm thinking? If you like it, comment down below. Like the video. Like I said, like the video. No matter what. If you like this or not, I want you guys to just like it. Click like. That's what I'm asking for you guys. I want to get to 1K subscribers. Come on, by the end of this year. Nah, I'm just kidding. That won't happen. Hey, you know what? It might happen. I'm at like 240, almost 250 subscribers. I think probably 250. So I'm a quarter of the way there. Not much further, you guys. Like, subscribe, share, all that. So I'm gonna just keep driving right now. I'll put some music on. Um, I'll I'll start filming once again once I'm back at the with the Range Rover. Like, check this out, you guys. This is the weather that we got going on today. There's actually forecast this week so tomorrow thursday uh it's expected to rain so not much then yesterday we actually had a client i thought it was going to slow down completely yesterday we had a client it was a missed opportunity 
but you know what that's fine he called us from a from a building over here it's a it's a really honestly it's a, a lot of wealthy people live there it's called 10,000 Santa Monica and he hit us up I have a Rolls Royce I want the full detail yeah I know it's 500 bucks I want you to come down and you know I was I already had made plans with the fam but you know what you can't take those you know too serious to um too to heart you know another opportunity will come but you know it would have been great add another another exotic luxury vehicle to you know to our weekly bi-weekly but yeah i just wanted to show you guys this weather getting super cloudy more every day but you know it's still beautiful out here i love it look who we just picked up it's your boy big leo look at <laughs> He's happy today. So we actually came to the address. He met me up over here where the client was supposed to be. And we get here and she's all like, oh, it's it's not that address, you know, it, it's a new address. I, and she's all like, I sent it yesterday. You probably didn't receive it. You know, she didn't send the address. But uh, so now we got to drive 25 more minutes to where it's actually at. So that's our, how our morning's going so far. At least this is the only appointment of the day, so we're not gonna be backtracked on anything, you know? So that's good. So, like I said, we'll hit you guys up once we get there, look at him. <laughs> Has this ever happened to you guys where you're already at the appointment and then they say, oh, well, you know what? It wasn't there, it was at this address. Like, comment down below. I mean, comment down below if it's ever happened to you. Let me know. This is, um, it's rare for us, but you know what? Happens to the best of us. You farted, huh? No, I didn't fart, Essex. Yeah, you did, bro. No, I didn't, bro. What the, bro? I gotta open the windows in here. No, whatever, bro. Stay away, this dude man. right here, man. This guy. Bro. You wanted to wear pants today? What yeah. would you wear? Shorts. <laughs> Leo's mad because he said, why didn't I wear shorts? Because I usually wear shorts and I wore pants today. <laughs> He wanted me to wear shorts with him. That's funny, huh? <laughs> You're funny, loco. You're funny, vato, I say. You're vato, loco. Now yeah, we're heading there still. What is that? What is she? Who? <laughs> right there, the girl you're looking at. I'm looking at, I'm looking at this, bro. I'm looking at girls. <laughs> what would you say? What'd you call her, the one you were looking at? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. No, nah, what'd you call her? Huh? What'd you call her? A what? A bombshell, bro. A bombshell. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <Woo! laughs> Leo's over there just falling in love. That's what he's doing over there. Oh, shit, just got to the vehicles right here. So it's going to be this Land Rover Defender and this Mercedes Benz actually. And we're only doing interior service on both. Check this out though. So they work in construction. I'm gonna flip the camera around and show you guys some shots of the interiors. Leo's prepping over there, setting up. Check that out. Need some love. Nothing too crazy. Actually, yeah, it is. Check that out. So he sprayed the mats with all-purpose cleaner. So it's actually good. So we're not doing any exterior since it's gonna rain tomorrow. But so we're doing full interior. We already got the mats out. This one should be a breeze since it's plastic instead of carpet. They empty out their vehicles. Yeah, look at that. So it's just gonna be a bunch of scrubbing in here. <clears throat> which is actually pretty good. Shouldn't be too much work. This one, we're actually gonna do a full interior. And they said that they spilled bleach in the trunk. So it has a Clorox odor. So what I recommended is we're gonna clean it. We're gonna detail it fully. And then we're actually gonna use the ozone machine. We're gonna run it probably about half an hour and see if the, we could get the odor removed on it. So let's go ahead, Leo. <clears throat> we're gonna start, <clears throat> start the seats. Let's start banging it out, scrubbing down the seats. I'm gonna start vacuuming. We're actually gonna blow everything out first. Just should be a lot simpler. Look at that, just with the blower. Just with the blower, it already looks good. So Leo's gonna start on the seats now. We're gonna bang it out. This one should be about, I wanna say two hours, maybe a little less. So okay, we're gonna man. go ahead, we'll just show you some clips right now. We're gonna 
do a little montage of clips of us just cleaning. I was right here telling the client, oh yeah, I brought my ozone machine, don't worry. So we could bang it out, you know, get that bleach smell out. Turns out I didn't even have it. So shout out to my girl. She came, dropped it off. So now I'm confident we could get remove that odor. But that's crazy, right? I thought it was in the van the whole time, but nope. Quick update right here. Check it out. Yo. Look at that. So far, she's looking great right now. I'm actually gonna get the order machine running on the other car right now while we're detailing this one just to see if that helps a little bit at all. Also, check out the view. Right here, like in the Hollywood Hills and on Mulholland Drive, it's beautiful out here. Just lovely day. Beautiful day to work too. Overcast, so it's not too hot, you know. Yeah, I would say we're about halfway through that job about the Range Rover. It's only been about like 45 minutes. The plastic material all around is just crazy nice to work with. So what's up, Leo? How's the detail going so far? It's going good, bro. You tired yet or no? Nope. You going strong? Too strong. You already did the seat? Yeah. Wow, look at that. So this seat's finished so far. I got the, the center console right here cleaned up. You know, we're still going to do final blowout and all that. Look at that steering wheel. Looking good, looking good so far. Remember how these seats looked back here? Check it out. Check that out. All that construction residue that was on it got all taken care of. Look at Leo right there, look. Making sure, making sure his work looks good. Look at it. He's making bro, sure on camera looks good. Look. Bro, that was, that was clean before, bro. <laughs> look at him, look at him. Hey, that's good to be proud though, Leo. He's all like, let me dust it off for the camera. <laughs> look at this, it's nice. We just gotta vacuum this top part. No big deal, but... I mean, she's looking really, really good. We're making great time on it too, honestly. This is before we even touch any of this, look. Just so you can see the door panels before, before we touch them. Super dusty, dirty. Hit that now. Nice and clean, just dusty. Not finished yet. But yeah, this so far, what we got going on. Not bad, right? And let me see what time it is actually. What time? What time is it? 11.49, I believe we got here like, I would say 10, 10.40. It's been an hour? There's no way it's been an hour. No, the, the client was here. They were um, prepping their vehicle for a while. Like they were actually cleaning stuff out. It hasn't been an hour, there's no way. I mean, if it has, no, it actually probably has. Huh? No, if it has, it's not even bad timing actually. Go into your detail on this one. We're charging them. For this one, it's 2.50 just the interior. So two hours is not bad. I'm gonna bang it out. And even like I said, so we got the bends next over there. Look. <laughs> What'd you say, Leo? Huh? Say it. I said, is it 250, 125, 125? <laughs> Leo's saying he's a boss now. Look at him. Everybody that I bring, they're just they're the bosses now. See what I mean? I become employee real fast over here. <laughs> you're taking you're taking my spot now, huh? Soon, bro. <laughs> like I said last video, so so like, comment, subscribe if you want more of Leo in these videos. Do you want more of Leo? Like, comment, subscribe. Come on, Leo. Woo! Woo! <laughs> Look at him. Come on. He knows. He, he knows what he's doing. Come on. Show some love to Leo, to big Leo over there. Show some love. So right now, Leo's getting the floor mats cleaned up. How are you guys Leo? We, we decided. Look. Since I'm the only one with the shirt, we gotta start a GoFundMe, all right? We're gonna start a GoFundMe. Let's get Leo a shirt. He has to be officially part of the team if he's gonna be here every day working with us. You know, you guys, comment comment down below. You think Leo needs a shirt? You think he's ready? You think he deserves it? Leo, what do you think? Yes, I do deserve you, it. You've been working hard? I've 
been winning day in, day in and day out, you know? <laughs> hey, comment down below if you think Leo needs a shirt. Let us know. So we're about 90% done with the Range Rover with the first one. And it starts raining. Well, it's like, it's like drizzling lightly. I don't know if you can see that. But it's drizzling lightly. Leo, if it rains, what, are we stopping? No. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? You don't care? You're gonna work in the rain? Damn, he doesn't care. I told him we'll just finish this one. He said no. It's just water, bro. It's just water? Yeah. Look at him. He said he's gonna work in the rain. It's probably the last good day of work we have over here, like for this whole week. And then plus the holidays coming. So honestly, it's Monday today. Um, so next Monday would be the the day after Christmas. So that'll probably be like the next day we work, if that. So we'll see. You know, there's random clients here and there, like in the driveways. I mean, like garages, parking structures. But honestly, we'll see. But yeah, we're gonna keep it pushing. We're still gonna go. Still going right now on this one. Look at those dudes in the back. What do you think they're doing? Okay, guys, now that we're 100% done. Oh, wait. Okay, so now that it's 100% done, what are your thoughts, Leo? <laughs> Leo's proud Speechless. of his work. Speechless. He said he has nothing to say. No words. You know what, you guys? Detailing is hard work, honestly. It really is. It looks like fun and games and all that, but it's a lot of work. Leo, you're a baker. What's harder, baking or, or detailing? None. <laughs> None. Leo says this is this is cake to him. This is easy. You get it? Cake. Piece of cake. Because you know? <laughs> he's a baker. Ah, uh, no, he's nothing, you guys. <laughs> oh man. Look at this. Now we're gonna show you some interior shots. Also, now, actually, we're gonna take a lunch break. We ordered some pizza. We're hungry, and then we're gonna start the Mercedes Benz. Let's check out this side now. Remember these seats were covered in that construction debris. Now they look like new. Door panels looking like new. And again, you guys, this was nothing that was done on the exterior. Interior only. Check that out. Huge difference to how she looked before. We even got in here. Check this out. We got all that. Yeah. While we were having lunch, we're starting this next one, but since the bleach spilled in the trunk, I had the ozone machine running in here. It was about like 20 minutes so far. I don't know if you guys ever like used one of those, but Man, like the, the odor that it like produces is like, yeah, you just, you, I guess you have to experience it. But, um, this is the next one. Foot interior service, check it out. I always say not so bad. I don't know why I always say not so bad and then once we're in there, it always ends up being so bad. But we're gonna get started. Show you guys some clips of the process all that i'm gonna tell you to record me you ready leo <laughs> he just ready to work <laughs> look at me oh yeah you never smelled the ozone right it smells, it smells like blood like blood you know like like after blood like you know when you're bleeding in there and you smell the blood that's what it smells that's like. what you think it's what see you guys i'm telling you if you haven't experienced the like the odor that it produces like yeah it's it's, it's weird i that's the first one I've never heard someone say blood. That's what like you think? dry blood, you know? <laughs> How much blood are you smelling? Like, you know when you have a burning <laughs> nose and you have blood? You just smell the blood. <laughs> <laughs> you hear him, right? <laughs> You're just smelling blood? Like, just... <laughs> no, bro, when you have a runny nose and blood just comes out, bro. And just, you know? <laughs> We're gonna get started, you guys. Yo, do Woody Woodpecker. <laughs> 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 Alright guys, just a little tip. So these adapters right here, 
They're perfect for like these little spots over here. They're perfect for your like, sides under the seat. Pretty much anywhere that this one won't fit because this is what we use for the majority of it. I want to say like 75%, 90%. This one you can just use it for all those small spots in the corners and everything. But these are gonna like drastically speed up your time, your working time. So honestly, this is a quick recommendation. We're gonna keep going. We're gonna get more clips of us kicking ass. So right now what we're doing is I'm hitting the steering wheel. And this is a you know woman owned car. So Look at those muscles. there's a lot of makeup all around it. So you need to use right actual, here. you know, just make sure you got all around, especially around here, shifters, all that, where they actually hold on to, especially behind it, don't be fooled. So you have to go all around the steering wheel to actually get good results. You know what I mean? And for some of you, you have to, you know what I'm saying? I'm here doing the final wipe down. Check it out. That's the after. Leo's packing everything up. We're gonna let the ozone machine. We're gonna actually let it run in here for about about like 30 minutes. So honestly, right now we're just gonna chill. Um, then let the client know that if um, you know, just let us know like about the odor, like in about like a week or anything. Or unless she notices like immediate difference that she doesn't smell like the Clorox anymore or the bleach. To be honest, I don't really smell it anymore. But we'll see. Like I said, we're gonna be out of the car for 30 minutes. We'll come back in and see exactly what we smell or whatever. This is the after of the full interior detail that we just completed. Looks great. Steering wheel was full of makeup. We got that all removed, front and back of it. So we're actually gonna let the ozone run. 30 minutes, Leo's packing up. Interior looks great though. Looks like brand new. So we're gonna get it going, set it for 30 minutes. And that's it. We should be good to go after that. Let's see, it's actually disconnected. There you go. So now it's on. 30 minutes. We're gonna close the door. I mean, that's pretty much it for this video. Um, nothing really exciting after this, so we're just gonna um, let it run. Once it's finished, we're going to let the client know that we're done. What do you think, Leo? I think it was a good day today. Good day. Look, no one else is here anymore. There was a bunch of construction workers right here in the back, but now they're all gone. It's just us and this one dude with the red truck. Man, we've been here about six hours now. Yeah, pretty much six hours. Not a bad day. Probably last day before, um, before Christmas, like last work day. But we'll see. We'll see. We, we'll see what pops up. You know, we're always ready for it. We're always ready for it. But like I said, um, Leo, any last words? Any last anything? For the people, no more smelling blood. You know, I gotta tell you that one for sure because I don't know what that's about. <laughs> all right, you guys, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Uh, we'll catch you on the next one. Al's Auto Detail, serving all Los Angeles County. Peace.